Hey y'all, it's your girl Empress Cheryl. So I'm about to do the weekly career reading, okay? So the weekly career reading asks how to move forward this week in terms of business, career, and finances. How to move forward this week in terms of business, career, and finances. Since this is a timeless reading, this week means the week in which you are tuning into this reading, all right? So Take the message that resonates for you and your situation, all right? I would like to invite my spirit guides, your spirit guides, and the Holy Spirit to come and protect us during this reading. It's clear and accurate insight on how to move forward this week in terms of business, career, and finances, okay? We have the emperor and the star coming out together. I really get this in two ways. There is either um, like a healing. So I got healing. Initially, I got bossing up. Then I got healing. Okay. So it's like maybe you're healing some sort of um, situation or healing some sort of connection, maybe bossing up and healing some sort of situation. You know what I'm saying? Like bossing up and healing some sort of connection. I kind of want to cover this, excuse me, a little bit too. But it's given the mindset of like taking charge of something or maybe you taking charge of um, healing something within your work or within your business um also just could just be you bossing up and being in this in the spotlight as well it's kind of what i'm getting from this also like you being the star but i'm also getting expressing something like maybe you're expressing some sort of um feelings or expressing your viewpoint like standing, yeah, so it's like standing up for yourself or standing up for something, standing up for some sort of cause and like um, expressing your viewpoint, you know, like pouring out your emotions about a particular situation. That's likely going to cause some sort of... <laughs> I just got havoc. It's likely going to cause some sort of like explosive moment or it's going to like catch somebody by surprise or it's going to like throw something off or throw something off whack. Let me just go ahead and point out that all cars that have came out so far are major arcana. So it's definitely giving me that it's some big moves being made this week um and that spirit is heavily involved in this as well okay so it's kind of like some big situations that are coming to like shake some things up throw some things off then we have the magician card here okay another major arcana it's like something that you it's like you end up manifesting what you want by stepping up and like speaking your mind on a situation or stepping up in the spotlight and like sharing your um sharing your feelings and in one in in one instance it's gonna like create some sort of tower moment is always going i really just got shit show as well like for some some people it may be viewed <laughs> it may view something as a shit show and murder it may create some sort of shit show in another situation but it's still you it's you taking charge of something is you manifesting what it is that you want is you creating what you want in a particular situation by you stepping up and taking control in it okay um there may still be some things that you are wanting to keep to yourself. There may still be some things that, and I just got this with like me saying like you're sharing, um, you're sharing your emotions on something. It may be like, because you are trying to make sure like it does not affect the finances of the business okay it's kind of what i'm getting or the finances of the team or it's kind of like you're doing something but doing something in a manner to where it's like not messing up the money 
is 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 the the energy that I'm getting from that. Or you did something to make sure that your money was secure. So like is okay, so it's like say you said something, say you said say you spoke out about something, say you did something to kind of like take control of the situation, like that was your way of like securing your money. Securing your bag is essentially what I'm getting. Like this is a week for you to speak up on something or say something, you know what I'm saying, that may create a little um havoc, may, you know what I'm saying, may unexpectedly throw some things off, but it's like it's it's allowing you to be in control of a situation. It's allowing you to make sure your money is secure, okay? This could be in, in regards to some past situation. Then we have this hermit card here as well. I'm getting this could be about a past situation that happened that you like kept hidden or that was like hell within or that was not seen or, or something like that so maybe some past situation comes up that like was not shown to others or that no one knew about or something like that that is like being expressed that is coming out now but it's it's giving me the sense of like it's coming out because now it's time for it to be shared or now this is the way for you to secure your money this is the way for you to secure your finances like you know what i'm saying and it may be but it's still giving the sense that everybody's not gonna like this like some may feel betrayed some may feel hurt by this coming out or this being shared or whatever but everything is fine everything is okay so there's something you're gonna have to like or something that i feel like you're gonna be um pushed to speak about or pushed to ex um expose or something like that it's like it's time for something to um be shared or it's time for you to take control of some sort of situation it's like you know what i'm saying like maybe it was meant to happen like this it was or maybe this is a way to kind of like turn the wheel in your favor in some sort of situation is kind of what i'm getting as well okay and even if it's not actually you speaking out this may be someone speaking it's just the energy of someone speaking out someone sharing their emotions which is going to like um catch others off guard which may like you know what i'm saying like create some sort of outrage or something like that but it's it's like whoever is doing this whoever is in this energy of speaking out is so they can try to gain control of some sort of situation is what i'm getting and maybe like secure their money i don't know if this was some sort of like partnership is kind of what i'm um getting as well like if this was some sort of um partnership or something that happened that is like things are like falling falling apart it's kind of like things are crumbling and it's like someone is trying to do something or someone is sharing something in order to kind of like save themselves or in order to like preserve their money in order to like you know what i'm saying hold on to what they have in order to keep their coins is what i'm getting it's like maybe someone is sharing about a past situation or something that ha that happened in the past that was maybe like hidden you know what i'm saying like kept hidden or you know what i'm saying i'm getting like closed books or you know what i'm saying like undercover or something like that um I feel like that's the way that it needs to go or it's time. That's something. Take how it's resonated for you and your situation. If you're this emperor energy, um, then you may be the one who is standing up and, you know, speaking about speaking out or standing up and putting things in um, order, putting things in their rightful place or fixing something, healing something, putting something back together or expressing how something happened expressing how something crumbled could be what that is as well just kind of you is is this energy of like sharing emotions but also sharing like a path of 
healing as well or a path of how you fix something, the path of how you repair something or, you know what I'm saying, or, or explaining like how something fell apart and how you put things back together in order to secure, in, in order to secure your finances or secure yourself. Like that's, that's the energy of this. So apply it to your situation, however you feel that it needs to be. Okay. And we have the messenger energy, um, Mercury. I bring the lights of awareness. So yeah, it's like sharing something, exposing something, like bringing light to a situation, like explaining like how something happened. If, if others were, um, left in the dark, bringing light to a situation. So now others understand or now others see, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like this energy of like changing the perception of something. Okay. Or even just communicating how things should be or how things could be um, moving forward as well. It's like giving insight. Okay. Then we have the administrator with Saturn energy, okay? I walk with a foot in both the earthly and spiritual worlds. Okay, so again, I did tell you with all of these major arcanas, this is like some heavy, like divine energy. It was supposed to happen. Things were supposed to happen in this manner type of way, okay? So trust that you are receiving like guidance, in your business moves or guidance in your, you know, like finances or how to handle your finances, how to handle challenges at work um, and things like that for this week. There's a need for you to be, we have assertive here. There's a need for you to be as assertive and disciplined in your actions as well. This is the time for you to be leading, okay? Um, and organized, okay? It's, it's just this mindset of like taking a stand for something. Maybe even it could be like trying to prevent something from crumbling, but it's like the mindset of something crumbling or something falling apart and like you trying to take matters into your own hands. That's what I'm getting. It's this energy of taking matters into your own hands to secure something, to make sure, you know what I'm saying? You keep something together or how it's supposed to be or secured, or preserved, or whatever, okay? This could be something that, um, something that you have had for a while, something that you have created, um, some older thing that you have created, maybe something that you created in your youth, or in your younger days, in your past, past situation. Maybe you're, like reintroducing that or bringing that about is also what I'm getting as well. Or maybe it's something that you had not shared to others that you had worked on previously, but never shared. And maybe it's like, now you're deciding to push it out. Now you're deciding to like reveal it. Is this energy of something being revealed? And I, I don't know if this is, a good or bad reveal is either like something being revealed because things are already crumbling or, you know, something being revealed has caused something to crumble or what, or it's going hand in hand, you know what I'm saying? Working, you know, hand in hand. Okay. Um, then we have the merchant. Mercury energy, opportunities to prosper are everywhere, okay? Many opportunities coming your way, though. Okay, also, despite whatever this is that is crumbling, many opportunities are coming your way um, in order for you to prosper. So it's the mindset to look at many different things. Do not, like, um, section yourself off to only one means of... um mega funds one one you know what i'm saying one means of like bringing in income it's kind of like having multiple ways um or multiple ways are going to come in to you um multiple ways to make money multiple i'm also getting like multiple creative um creative or inventive um opportunities are coming in as well just for your finances to start 
flowing or just for you to secure something. We have social here as well. Maybe with you talking to others, communicating with others. Um, that may be a way that you're allowing your um, finances to increase. Okay, so maybe you need to talk to more people, okay? Communicate with people, be social this week, okay? Maybe you're seeing what someone needs, but you're reconnecting with others um, from your past as well and kind of like seeing how you can um, assist or how you, how you all would be beneficial, how you all can work together or something like that. Okay, we have 41 with decrease. Decline, cutting back, frugality, contraction, letting go, less is more, resourcefulness, a sacrifice. You may have to sacrifice something. You may have to cut back on something. You may have to, or, you know, or something may be being cut back, okay? Whether this is um, hours, okay? Because it's also, it's giving me this mindset of like, whether you are, you know, actually controlling this and you're pulling back from something or not, this is really just giving me the energy of like, maybe something will be cut back, whether this is like hours or some sort of opportunity, but there's this reassurance that opportunities to prosper are everywhere. So it's like, you may have to look into other means um, this week, okay? And we have 32, duration, constancy, continuity, endurance, perseverance, maturity, strengthening, stability, a deep commitment. There also may be something that you need to commit to or something that would be more stable um, that is coming in as well. So as there is, that's the, that's the energy here also is like deciding to see what would be stable what is something that would be lasting what is something that like could stand the test of time is is the type of energy here okay what could endure we have number 20 contemplation detached observation solitude increased understanding integration through reflection this is giving me this mindset of like you going and thinking something over. So maybe you have to, maybe you get some sort of information and you have to like go back and look it over. But it's like, this is talking about in solitude or in integration through reflection. So it's like getting with yourself and looking something over or getting with yourself and thinking something over you know what i'm saying like to figure out what is the best choice or the best pattern or the best way to move forward this is like something with this increased understanding is like spirit is going to give you more insight this week on how to move because again we had this i walk with a foot in both the earthly and spiritual worlds spirit is going to give you the insight that you need but you're gonna have to like get to yourself in order to like in order to understand in order to like really realize in order to really see in order to get that like full understanding of how to move forward so get some also with this gaining overview like i just get the mindset of like maybe someone presenting something to you and you getting like an overall picture of her, a picture of it, like an overall understanding of what this is, whether this is a project that you're trying to work on, whether this is um, like another opportunity or something like that on how you move forward. It's giving me the mindset of you getting some sort of like overview of what it is, but you still needing to kind of go back and see with yourself in order to get like... A better understanding and and the thing that you would need to sit with yourself is what i'm getting is whether you whether this is something that is actually stable whether this is something that you would be able to commit to moving forward whether this is something that would be able to bring you security it's giving me like job security um the mindset of job security okay so um and if it's not like, you know what I'm saying, job security is like, is this a, you know, a business venture that you want to move into that you see would be financially beneficial or that you see, you know, would be something that would develop over time or something like that, okay, is 
the mindset that I'm getting. Okay. So these are y'all messages is definitely giving me the feeling of like some big changes this week or something being expressed that is going to like shock you or knock something over or whatever. But it's in a sense, it's giving you the opportunity to get back into get back in control of a situation all right so these are the messages for y'all y'all take care this is how you move forward this week in terms of business career and finances take care and have a jazzy day